Hi, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I will show you how to create a custom ribbon command in Excel using VBA macros. With this custom ribbon, we can place triggers to run the procedures we create, making them easily accessible directly from the ribbon. First, create a file and save it as an Excel macro enabled workbook with the extension XLSM. In this example, the file is named ribbon exercise.xlsm. Next, close the file, navigate to the directory where the file is saved, and change its extension to zip. Next, open the file using winrar, then copy the .rels file, located in the underscore rels directory by dragging and dropping it into the Windows Explorer window where the file is stored. Next, after copying the .rels file, open it using Notepad. Inside the file, add a new relationship tag with the following details, ID, report, target, custom UI slash my underscore custom UI dot XML. This points to the XML file where we will define the custom ribbon. Next, create a folder named custom UI, matching the folder name specified in the .rels file we edited earlier. Next, inside the custom UI folder, create a file named mycustomui.xml. This file will contain the list of commands that we will place on the ribbon. Make sure the file name matches the target name specified in the .rels file we created earlier. Next, open the mycustomui.xml file using Notepad. In this example XML format, we will define a ribbon tab named Report, which contains a group called Summary Report. This group will have two command buttons, button 1 and button 2, with labels dataset and create report respectively. For the image MSO attribute, you can change the icon to any of your choice. To find the available image MSO names, search on Google using the keyword image MSO. On the website bergtoolkit.com, you can choose the icon that best fits the button you want to place on the ribbon. You can then copy the image MSO name from the website and paste it into the mycustomui.xml file placing it in the image MSO attribute for each button. Next, open the Excel file, which still has the .zip extension, using WinRAR. First, navigate to the underscore rels folder and drag and drop the .rels file that we edited earlier into the zip file. Next, copy the custom UI folder that we created, along with a mycustomui.xml file, and paste it into the zip file as well. After moving the .rels file and the custom UI folder into the zip file, rename the file and change its extension back to .xlsm, which is the Excel macro enabled workbook format. Now, open the Excel file. If there are no errors, you should be able to see a ribbon tab named report, with one group called report containing two buttons, dataset and create report. When you click the buttons, an error will appear because the on action macros are not yet available. This happens because we haven't created them yet. Next, we will create macros for these two buttons, matching the on action attribute name specified in the mycustomui.xml file we created earlier. In the Visual Basic Editor, insert a new module to store the macros that will run when the ribbon buttons are clicked. For this example, I renamed the module to ribbon. Next, in the module, create a sub with a name that matches the on action attribute specified in the mycustomui.xml file. Make sure to include a parameter like control as I ribbon control. In this example, when the dataset button on the ribbon is clicked, the macro will run and display a message box. After creating the sub, you can test it by clicking the dataset button on the ribbon. A message box should appear, as defined by the macro code you created. Repeat the same process for the next button to ensure it functions as expected. In conclusion, creating a custom ribbon in Excel using VBA macros allows you to personalize and streamline your workflow. By modifying the XML structure, linking it to your workbook, and writing appropriate VBA code, you can design ribbon commands that directly trigger your macros, making your tasks faster and more accessible. If you follow these steps carefully, you'll have a fully functional custom ribbon tailored to your needs. 
Don't forget to explore image MSO icons to enhance the visual appeal of your ribbon. Thank you for watching. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more tutorials like this. See you in the next video.